Guys, welcome back to more. This is the last uh, Lost Paradise. Uh, let's continue. So yeah, we're searching for Kyoto, I believe, right? Here and I barely have any. Wow, well, my uh, barely have any ideal to my name. I hear it's central, so I'd love to get some. What do I say? What do you say? Sounds good. Very well. <laughs> Thanks. Truth be told, I bought the, this armor from someone in Eden. <laughs> Someone in Eden? Who? The guy in the black... The guy in the back of the alley of the John district. He said he'd... He said he works at a repair shop. A repair man? Mm -hmm. He used to have a mohawk. He shaved it off and went straight. Because he can't hide the mouth of his. <laughs> Skinhead repairman in the back and the other junction. Hey, that's amazing! Good going. Is it that time already? It's not. It's not. Oh. I like that. Yeah. Thirsty. Huh? <laughs> the town was still peaceful before he came. What? 
you need to do something about it. They're talking about me. No help to shoot him to you, okay. I'll come back to you guys later. There's another sub thingy I need to do. I might do it after we hear about subs and sex. I've hardly done any sub. Show the pad. Show the pride. That's the third one? There's three on the map now. Shoulder pad killer, huh? <sighs> All right, old man. I'll talk to you later. Let's talk to this dude first. He's the story. So, let me see the map now. There's that one. That one. This one over here. There's some in the barracks by the looks of it, some over here. Man, there's some, and then there's one even in there, question mark right there. Oh, not question mark, exclamation mark? Let's talk to this guy first. Hey, hmm? what do you want? Can you tell me about the army of Hey. find out who I am, they'll throw me out of the city. I was finally able to land a legit job, and the boss is actually starting to take me seriously. I'm sorry. Whatever. So, what about the army? Do you know where they're at? What are you planning to do? I'm going to see Kyogo. You serious? Yeah. Oh yeah. You're the guy that beat him back, right? You doing this to keep the peace? Fine. The army of ruins always moving around. Or at least they were when I was with them. We'd just keep moving and moving, and then we'd stop in the middle of the desert. It's one of the reasons I left. Uh, maybe they'd eventually take us somewhere nice and cozy. Oh boy, was I wrong. It was all just camping in the desert all the fucking time. Thank God Eden opened up those gates. That's all you know. Hold your horses, I'm getting to it. I've heard rumors that there's someone who decides where they stay. Who? He's some old-timer they call him the Sage of the Desert. I'm not sure why, but whenever he visits, there's an order to move out. Where can I find him? Supposedly, he's near some rocky mountains south of Eden. But there's a lot of rocky mountains out there. Anyway, that's all I know. Don't tell my boss about any of this, alright? Got it. All right, before we go to that old man, let's do some sub stories. Let's do this old man sub story. Good hero guys goes to good people, that's always been my motto. But lately, this shoulder killer who's gone and ruined my business. Sales have been terrible thanks to him. Shoulder killer? Hmm. He loves shoulder pads so much that he attacked anyone wearing them and swipes them right off their shoulders. He scares away every one of my customers into considering their always to think someone like that exists. Mm. It's great. He loves shoulder pads. You know, my 
just because it's funny. It's never gonna you know perhaps my time in this business has come to an end. But I want I don't want to stop. I want to keep working and to try and convince the show to go to stop the dabbing the people. He's a violent one but he loves show defense. So he can be all bad. I should be able to stop him. Does anyone know where he is? No. I'm still looking for him, but it's hard for an old man like me. I do have a plan though. Can you help me find a show to so No one else will help you because they're afraid of him. For the future of shoulder pads, I beg you. I accept. Yeah. I'm here to do the... I'm going to do all the three... We see three of them. Three sub-stories. So I'm going to do all three of them in this video. But I've not done much sub-stories. And it'll help us level up. <laughs> three nights and three... Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what do you think? I call it sh shoulder seduction. <laughs> <laughs> this is the best pad I've ever made. He's bound to show up. Are you sure this will work? Yes! Maybe. He'll get suspicious if I'm here with you. So. Good chance to hide. Good luck. <laughs> I wonder if he's really going to show up. Didn't show up. Mm. Yeah. <sighs> Plan B? Yes. We'll try something like a little simpler, I hope. You The lives of Eden's shoulder pad lovers are on the line. As is my life as a shoulder pad craftsman, please. Except. Yes. Plan B. Oh, multi shoulder pads. <laughs> Yeah, you know what fairy tale that is, Hansel and Gretel, right? Mm. With the whole crumbs, bread breadcrumbs, but in the case of breadcrumbs, it's shoulder pads. All right, <laughs> that is so funny. I sure fell asleep. He 
you must be the show to back to us. What the hell? This is kind of chat. Why are you little? Because some people do for some something this obvious. What? Can allow you to keep doing what you're doing. Why are you stealing shoulder pads? As a shoulder pad lover, you, know, you should know better. This is not how we treat our precious shoulder pads. <laughs> the hell are you talking about? I don't love these things. Ooh. What? Then why are you going after them? They made me some serious pitching, that's all. Especially them high class custom made ones. They go for a lot. So I hunt down the guys wearing them. Wearing this. No, I put my heart and soul into those pads. Oh, you made those? Perfect. You should work for me. What are you saying? You make these shoulder pads and I'll sell them for some good beef. Pretty solid little scheme, ain't it? <laughs> oh, fuck with the shoulder pad craftsman. <laughs> oh, what good he actually said that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ouch. Whoa. He got punched. He got, he got gut scramps, I'll give you that. Do you know my motto? Show the pad killer? Huh? What are you talking? What are you on about? Good show the pads go to good people. That's my motto. I should make show the pads for people who wear them with pride. They're not for you to do as you please with. I won't let you have them, even if it kills me. If it's an old shoulder pad maker, you don't know shit. Hey. That's enough. And who are you? You have no right to hold those shoulder pads. We're gonna fight? Alright. I'll start with you. Come on, let's do this shoulder pad dude. Low life. Those shoulder pads are good. I could use them if they're great. Well, check it out. Shoulder pads go to good people. Shoulder pads, shoulder pride. Nice. Yeah, look at that. By not doing these, I'm not actually leveling up on my. That's some decent XP. Alright, let's see what he gave me. He gave me some shoulder pads. So, EX shoulder pads. There they are. 4 defense, 10 blades, 5 shots. And what's my current one? 12 blades, 6 defense. 50 shots. My current one's better. You duped me, old man. Let's do this one as well. Show the pants, man. No. We'll do this one and then we'll put it here. What are you talking about me? Oh, oh no, it's Kenshiro. Are you going to kill us now? Please don't use Hokuto Shinkan on me. I don't want to die. I'd never do that. Hmm. Oh, really? Tell that to the people you've murdered. Hey. Alright, everyone. 
Let's calm down for a second. He doesn't understand the situation yet. It's nice to meet you, Kenshiro. But we are the neighborhood safety committee. Aren't the Andos already gone? Yes! Unlike the city watch, we keep eating safe in a civil and dignified manner, okay? <laughs> we try to solve problems not through violence but through peaceful conversation. <laughs> okay? <laughs> this is funny. So you're pacifists. Ah, uh, you've been helping us. Around town, he's earned a lot of people's trust. But we would. The two wrongs don't make the right. And the end don't. It's justify the means, okay? Violence isn't the answer to everything. Neither is Hokuto Shinki. Um. People can't learn if they are dead. There's no such thing as bad person, only bad choices. <laughs> That's right, you said it. <laughs> Really? Don't, wouldn't you agree, Kenshiro? Well, hold on. Don't just walk away. Get us out. We all want the same thing, is to protect people. Therefore, Hokuto Shinken is hereby forbidden. If you want to help, then do it without resorting to violence. Easy for them to say. <laughs> yeah, it is easy for them to say. Hand over your food, huh? Give me your last what? Or I'll kill y'all. <laughs> Please, I can't let my little ones starve. Oh? Oh no. Mr. Chairman, there's a problem over there. Look, Kenshiro. You've got trouble. Go solve this situation and hurry. Fine. can remember. Practice no violence. Try to talk to him. Sure his behavior makes you feel <laughs> Sure how his behavior makes you feel. Try to make this world safe in a place. Pacifism, huh? Right. Have a conversation. Anyone can change if you give them a chance. There's no such thing as bad people, only bad choices. You should be careful. Hmm? No, Mr. Chairman. Yeah, All right, let's get back to business. <laughs> Guess I don't have a choice. In the end, the whole so-called peaceful negotiations didn't work. I haven't done this in such a long time. In the end, the so-called peaceful talk rubbish didn't even work, man. It failed miserably. Thank you so much. My child won't go hungry. Thanks to you. Has a little token of my appreciation. One start to end of it. Now go home to your family. Yes, of course. I'll never forget this. Thank you. Are you okay? I think so, though I thought it was a corner for a sec. <sighs> but damn gosh. Fine was only out of me. I need to check it out. Easier said than done. Well, you did save us, so I'll let you off with a warning. But next time, better work things out peacefully. Or else. <laughs> This dude doesn't even know anything, bro. What did I just get myself into? No, this dude is so gullible. Violence is always the answer, bro. You get attacked in this game regularly. So, like, if violence is not the answer, what's the answer then, huh? Telling me that. 
yeah, fine, I understand, like, sometimes kindness is not the answer, but come on. Alright. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this walkthrough of Fistles of Our Last Paradise. And until next time guys, see ya. Bye.